They have so much uh, for which to be proud. Everything they've done over the summer has been thrilling. It has been thrilling. Our Kimberly Gill live on the red carpet in Hollywood. And Kimberly, so much drama tonight. Second place, it's still a big accomplishment. Oh, my goodness. It certainly is. Sandra and Devin, good evening to you. Live from Hollywood. Yeah, you know, it, being behind the scenes there, the last 30 minutes of this show was just so intense. I, I couldn't take it, I, and I don't know... I can't imagine how they felt just being on the stage, but there were a few of the kids that were behind the scenes uh, where we were watching the screens as they announced the final five, and that was so dramatic. They just went nuts when they announced it. Let's cue up that video from when they uh, announced that on the stage. Detroit you dramatic there just exciting uh, the crowd went wild but as we know it went down to the final two Cody Lee uh, was the winner of this competition yeah, so we were able to talk to the Detroit Youth Choir on the red carpet tonight about their excellent, excellent run, and here is what they had to say. I'm really happy for Cody Lee. I love him so much, but like we, I still feel like we won, like no matter what. So yeah, I feel like this is a big W in our book, and like I feel like, like I just want to thank Detroit for everything that they've done for us. Like we felt Detroit when we was up there performing. I'm like, I'm going to do this for Detroit. Detroit, we want to thank you. We support you. We humble. We are so humbled and blessed to be a part of this experience and it's all because of you. You have voted Michigan. You have voted. You have put a statement on the hearts of AGT. They, uh, we love you and we appreciate WDIV, uh, City Council, the mayor, the governor. I mean, everybody just stand up. Detroit, stand up. Yeah, this is this is what happens when a community comes together to support uh, this choir, and it's just been a really amazing run, guys. So I am still here trying to work the red carpet, trying to talk to some of the judges. If you pan down there, you can see Simon Cowell down there, uh, and a couple. Of, we talked to uh, Gabrielle Union a little bit earlier, and uh, it's just been amazing. We're so proud of Detroit Youth Choir. Uh, be sure to tune in for the news in the morning. I will have the uh, reaction from the judges that I get here on the red carpet until. Until then, we'll send it back to you in Detroit. Reporting live on the red carpet in Hollywood, Kimberly Gill, Local 4. Kim, I was texting you during the show. It was so tense in the newsroom. Can you even describe what it felt like in the, in the auditorium that night? You, you know what? I, I had tears in my eyes, Devin. I have become so close to this choir that they yeah. feel like family. They feel like my little nieces and nephews or something. I don't know. I, I can't really describe it, but we are so, so proud of them. It really doesn't, it feels like they won tonight, and, and they did. Be, I mean, just look how the city turned out for this and, and our community. I'm so proud. I'm so proud of them. I'm so proud of Detroit. So we'll be coming back tomorrow and, uh, and celebrating on Friday. We should well, we're going to talk more about that now. Safe travels, Kim. We'll see you back here soon. Uh, we hope you'll join us Friday. Our DYC homecoming party is in Campus Martius. It starts at 4 p.m., 4 in the afternoon, and it is open to everybody.